In this question, we're asked to find x, showing all of our reasons. Now, the method here is to gradually work out any angles we can, and to explain along the way our steps or our logic. Now, first of all, I can find this angle here quite easily, because there's a straight line there. So I can find angle DEC. So angle DEC must be 180 minus 41. And 180 minus 41 is 139 degrees. So that is 139. The reason being that angles on a straight line add to 180. So I know 139 and I want to find x. Now if I knew this angle here, then I could find x quite easily. And we can find that in the following way. Now, if I look at this angle here, this angle here is A to D to C. Now, this here forms almost like a C shape. And this angle here plus that angle there add to 180. So angle A to D to C must be 180 minus 120, which is 60 degrees. There's a name for that, and they're called supplementary angles. So I know that entire angle there is 60. So I can therefore find angle E, D to C. Angle E, D to C must be 60, take away 38, which is 22 degrees. So therefore I've now found out that angle there. Then to find angle X, I will just do 22 plus 139, which is 161 degrees. Then angle X must be 180, take away 161, which is 19 degrees. And that's because the angles in the triangle add to 180 degrees.